Hey guys, Rush Rage Average here, and I'm back in another video, guys. I know it's been a while, it's been like a week since I made a video, but that is because um, I had a lot of schoolwork to do this week, so thankfully this Friday, which is when I'm recording this, I don't know if it'll go up on Friday, but basically I actually had time to do it this time because I actually finished all the work before Friday last week. Actually, I didn't finish all the work till Friday, which was insane, but. Today, I have no work to do. I'm all cool. I can make a video. I'm just gonna show you guys some pops I picked up recently. Um, thankfully, I don't. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, I actually picked up two pops. I think I might show them both in this video, but um, if I don't, uh, there'll be a part two going up soon. So, this is a grail. Uh, yeah, it's a grail. It's a grail. I'm gonna say it. it's 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 a grail pop. It's over a hundred dollars. It's one that people want. to go right here. This one, I'm going to, have to show you, actually goes here. Well, for now, eventually I'm going to bring downstairs. But, that's why I moved the setup around at the top, too. Again, I always I always change it all the time. So you guys will always probably see, like, different stuff up there. But, as you see, the Dragon Ball Z Kai box that's there. I have Sloth right there, Baseball Fury. We've got some Sorcerer, Mickey, Jimmy Crickets, and Moss and stuff up there. So, yeah, I moved it around a little bit. And then, this pop's supposed to go right there. And that's why there's a hole. But, here it is. Galactic Toys exclusive. Glow Chase version of Legendary Super Saiyan Broly 6 inch. Yes. This pop is amazing. And it's also for the 30th anniversary of Dragon Ball Z, which was last year. That's what that sticker is. Um, I actually really like the 30th logo. It has like uh, Goku and Vegeta on it and stuff. Um, all the 30th anniversary stuff they created or made. Last year had that basically on it, so it was really cool. I believe this shirt I'm wearing has it on too, yeah. It has it right there. There's anniversary during Will Z again. So, this is the Black and Soul exclusive, and it's actually crazy because it's a 6 inch too. And I don't think. Is there another Glow 6 inch? Oh, yeah, I have one. Um, Tyrant from Resident Evil is actually a Glow in the Dark 6 inch pop. That one is not a Chase, so that's a Target exclusive. I don't know if there's any Glow Chase 6 inch pops other than this one. But, yeah, this is definitely the only, I think it's the only Chase Dragon Ball, uh, Dragon Ball Z 6 inch. So, that's really, really cool. But, I have the regular one. But this one, the, basically the only difference is with this one and the regular one is that he has the green energy around him. And then he also has the base in there as well. If you guys, oh, you can see it. Yeah, see? See in the bottom there? The base he's standing on. If you guys know this pop, you know exactly what I'm talking about. And if you guys know Dragon Ball Z, you know exactly what I'm talking about. But the green thing at the bottom of there. Also glows, I believe. It's eyes, I don't think glow. Maybe they do. I don't know. But I haven't actually tested it. I've waited literally like almost a week just to test it to like do a reaction on camera to testing it. Uh, but I, I've like, I UV'd it like a little bit without the lights off just to see if it's actually a glow or not and it looked like it glowed. Alright guys, so I just um, ran out of space there. Uh, I had to delete some things. But yeah, as I was saying, I went over there with the UV flashlight, I think. I think that's what I said, right? I went over the UV flashlight. And check those the glow. I mean, it's pretty obvious that it is the glow. It looks literally like clear plastic and looks like it glows in the dark. But just in case, you know, it is possible just to take the other pop, stick the sticker on there, and say it's the glow version. Boy Bought This Up is definitely a person that we trust. And even if it was the non glow, I wouldn't even blame him at all. I would probably, the person that sold it to him probably did it. So I don't blame him. Shout out to our boy, Pete. Um, he's definitely a big homie for. Uh, hooking me up with this. He did a really good deal on the stuff that we bought of him. We also bought some my dad collects old video games. We bought some old video games as well. Um, we actually, if you guys don't actually know, I don't know if I mentioned the video, but you know I have the popping downstairs right next to it, we have the game room too, so you guys didn't know that. But yeah, he actually we gave us a really good deal on all the stuff that we bought, so that's awesome. And I also love that this one it has I like that it has so many stickers on it, you know, it looks really cool that it has all of them on there. 
My other one, well, it has the exclusive sticker instead because it's not from Galactic Toys, but I could have bought it off Galactic Toys, and we pro probably should have because it's basically we realized, we realized after that it was like basically the same to buy it off Galactic Toys as where we bought it, and probably better. And I didn't get the chase when I bought that one either, but I guess I got it now anyway. And if it was a regular size pop. It would be like all over the box. You probably wouldn't even be able to see the pop in there. Sometimes stickers cover up stuff, such as uh, a good example of that is uh, the Waldo. Where's Waldo? Barnes and Noble exclusive with Woof. The one I'm actually looking for. The Barnes and Noble sticker literally covers up Woof. Actually, uh, really a review, uh, per se, like one of my reviews that I've made. But I think I'm going to show you guys close up anyway, so you guys can actually see them more. Uh, just because I know I'm going to show them out of box. I will actually make a full review of this later on. Um, eventually, you know, but I will probably show you guys one closer up so you guys can actually see him better. Uh, I guess this is kind of like a mini review, a little preview, because in the actual review, I'm going to compare both of them as well. So, whenever uh, I make it, so let's actually get you guys closer to Broly so you guys can see him more. Guys, here we are, close up to Broly. Um, actually, Pete actually hooked it up with a protector as well, so that's actually awesome. I get to put in a protector. Obviously, it's not good for this, so I'm actually going to take it out of protector, but. You know, a lot of you guys know, 6-inch protectors are, they do exist, as you can see. But, other than the 3-inch protectors, the other sizes are basically, like, almost impossible to get. Well, not impossible, but they're just harder to come by, like, 2-pack, or... I even have a couple ride protectors, as well. There he is. He's number 623 in pop animation from Dragon Ball Z. Of course, there's the Dragon Ball Z version of Broly. They have not made the super version yet of Broly, but... I actually think that this one looks cooler anyway, so... I guess so. Legendary Super Saiyan Broly. Of course, you guys can see him in there. There he is. This one's so awesome. I, I, I don't know. I, I just think it's really awesome. For some reason here, he looks really, really small on here. I don't know why that is. He should be like way bigger on the picture. Why is he this small on the side? Does Does anyone know why he is this small on the side? But yeah, 623. Legend Super Pop animation. Not that those damage, but it was just a Dragon Ball. Yeah, this pop's basically in mint condition. Um, so yeah, it's really good. That's in mint condition. And this, uh, this pop's from this wave right here, which is, I believe, this is wave 6 of Dragon Ball Z. Uh, Naka Vegeta, Goku, Raditz, Shishi, Goten, Frieza, and Kid Buu. That's a really cool wave. I actually bought, uh, almost, I think almost this entire wave off of Pete as well, actually. Except for a couple of these. I think I bought this one. Yeah, maybe I had Vegeta and Goku before, but then I bought the rest off of Pete, actually, which is funny. That I also got this Broly off of him too. So, pop animation, 623. Funko Toei animation. And. I didn't say Funimation on there for some reason. Here we go, we got the bottom of it right there. You can scan it into your collection. I've already added it to my collection. It's worth 114 uh, Canadian. I'm actually in Canada, so it's a little bit different. There it is again. Also, I feel like he should be bigger here too. I don't understand. Maybe these pictures. Are these pictures just like taken from the SDCC one, but then. Just with the electricity, right? Well, how do you even make it? That did, like, what? I don't, I don't know. I was just guessing. Maybe it's just the SDCC one with the electricity around it, but how do you even, like, make it, like, behind? Like, you might as well just make new, like, glam shots if you can, like, Photoshop it or make it different. I don't, I don't know why it's so small there, but I'm not even going to put it on its side, so mine goes frontwards for sure, so it doesn't really matter how you put it. The front is really what matters. At least he's huge on the front, so that's good. He actually matches the size on the front instead of the side. I don't know what's going on with that. But, yeah. Anyway, guys. Hey guys, Retro Bay Derby here. Um, so here we are testing Glow. I know it's going to be very difficult. Very, very difficult to see. But, here he is. Legendary Super Saiyan Broly. Uh, so, as you can see, oh, his eyes do glow. I believe they're supposed to glow. Yes, they do. And as you can see inside, the energy base is supposed to glow, and the electricity is supposed to go slow. And as you can see inside the base there, his eyes and the electricity glow. So, yeah, I actually forgot to film this, guys, and I just remember while I was editing, so I had to edit this in there. When you hear this, go into the dark sections. Six-inch Legendary Super Saiyan Broly, glowing, nice. Guys, uh, yeah, I'm gonna actually make a part two of this video with the second pickup I got from him since this video is getting a little long since I've been talking long. So, yeah, uh, make sure to subscribe uh, to my channel for more Funko Pop videos and more Dragon Ball Z related uh, videos. 
Um, make sure to like this video. Uh, comment what you guys think about this pop. And uh, what grail should I get next? Because um, I'm kind of wanting to buy more grails, you know. But yeah, so comment down below what grail I should get. Share this video with your friends, especially the like Dragon Ball Z, because Dragon Ball Z is awesome. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. What's a little dog, dude?